Welcome to Sully University. This video will introduce you an efficient FBA operation using Scan and Ship. Note that Scan and Ship can only be used for products labeled by sellers. It is not applicable if the products are commingled or if you want to use label service. The primary benefit of Scan and Ship is that it helps save time and reduce errors. Scan and Ship eliminates the need to search through an entire sheet of labels for the correct one, or click through pages in your account to find the products you want to ship. Furthermore, your shipment will become an object for Speed Receive, which enables your shipment to be received about 40% faster than a normal receiving speed at FCs. Prepare these items to start Scan and Ship. Products registered in your Seller Central Computer, Pickup List, Boxes, Packing Tape, Scanner, Label Printer, and a roll of blank labels. You can purchase Scanner, Label Printer, and Label Roll at Amazon.co.jp. Find them by searching Scanner, Label Printer, and Label Roll. Configure the Scan and Ship setting beforehand. For more details, please search Scan and Ship in Seller Central. In order to operate efficiently, set these items in a straight line. If there are more than one product, we recommend using baskets to divide into the same product groups. There are nine steps in this operation. Step 1. Prepare products. Pick up products based on your pickup list. This is a sample of the list. Since we have two different products here, use two baskets to divide it into the same product groups. Step 2. Inspection and other preparation. Bring the products to workstation. Check each item to make sure that there is no defect. Note: Keep products in the same box during the operation and do not mix items in different boxes. Step 3. Scan and print FPA labels. Go to Seller Central. On the Inventory tab, click Manage FBA Shipments. Then click Scan and Ship to begin. Scan barcode on the product. The product information will be displayed on the screen. Then click Print Label to print our FBA labels. In order to prevent operational errors, put the printed labels into the corresponding basket. Make sure to match the label with the right basket. Step 4. Attach labels on products. Pick up products from the basket and attach FBA label on the product's barcode. Make sure that the original barcode on the product is completely covered by FBA label. Failure to comply with FBA product preparation requirements may result in the refusal of inventory at FC. Step 5. Check quantity. Once finished attaching labels on the products, return them to the basket. Check if the quantity of the label differs from the number of the product by looking if any labels are left. Suspect operational errors in earlier steps if you find any difference in number. Step 6. Create shipment and pack products. Click Build Shipment. Name your shipment ID in the box of Create a New Shipment and click Go. Click Start a New Box and print Box Barcode. Attach the box barcode to a box. Then scan the FBA label of the product. 
The product will be displayed on Seller Central. Put the products into the box. When your box is full and you're done packing the products, write down on your pickup list the quantity of the products inside the box. And also enter the same quantity on Seller Central. If you need another box to continue packing, please repeat the step from where you print out box barcode. Click Start a new box. Then click Reprint box barcode to print. Then attach the box barcode to a new box. Then scan the products. Check if they have been added to the list. And then pack them into the box. When you finish packing all the products, write down the quantity on the pickup list and enter the same quantity on Seller Central. Step 7. Select Carrier. Click Select Carrier and select the carrier which will deliver your shipments to FC. Step 8. Attach Shipping Label. Click Print Labels to print out Shipping Label. The shipping labels and box barcode have running numbers. Please attach the shipping label to the box with corresponding running number. Click Complete Shipment to finish. Step 9. Shipping. Your products will be sellable once they are checked in at FCs. Let's quickly review each steps. Step 1. Pick up products. Step 2. Inspect and prepare to meet FBA product preparation requirement. Note that baskets help prevent operational errors. Step 3. Scan products and print out FBA labels. Step 4. Attach labels on products and Step 5. Quantity check. Make sure that there is no difference in the quantity of products and FBA labels to detect errors. Step 6. Pack products and create shipment. If you are using more than one box, make sure that you are packing in the box with the right box barcode. Step 7. Select carrier. Step 8. Attach shipping labels. Make sure to attach the shipping label to the box with corresponding box barcode. Step 9. Ship products. The products will be sellable once they are checked in at the FCs. We hope you have better idea to enhance your FBA operation.